I conducted my surgeries on Friday and I had advice from the Kent Police about uh, safety. Uh, they didn't feel there was a change to the level of risk. Until we get to the bottom of this uh, attack, what the perpetrator was thinking, whether it was organised or planned, I'm not prepared to put my safety and my, more importantly, my staff at risk. I've always felt uh, uh, perfectly safe and always, uh, if I need to call on people for uh, security then, uh, and one has concerns, uh, then I've been able to do so. Women seem to attract more of the online trolling abuse. Um, it can be very difficult for us as women. We do get briefings on uh, precautions we should take, uh, things we should do to keep, keep ourselves safe, but MPs are a visible part of the communities that they serve and are accessible. We are public figures, that's part of the job. We're meant to be approachable to our constituents. And of course, out there, there are uh, mentally disturbed people uh, who at their most extreme will behave in an appallingly irrational way. But we need women in politics and we need mums in politics, especially because so much of our politics affects young people and the next generation. And that's why I really, really feel for all the mums in politics. I did a big reach out to other mums. We've all felt, you know, this has made us more insecure. But look, nobody gets paid enough to be threatened with violence and we're still attacked uh, whilst doing the job. Probably MPs are far more accessible than many people realise and that is a part of the job. So I think we have to get the balance right between you know, keeping safe and also keeping accessible.